Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Red Bank Regional is being brought to you by Risers Landscape Supply. Red Bank Regional hosting the Albert E. Martin Buck Classic. RBR, the four seed in their own tournament, facing off against number five, Monmouth Regional. The Bucks bust open a 12-8 first quarter lead with a huge second quarter. This is junior Enoch Hutchinson showing off the Euro step. That's a big time move. Hutchinson had nine points in the second quarter. Then Nick Farragine goes strong to the 10, a precursor of things to come. At the half, Red Bank Regional opens up a double digit lead. It's 30-17. The third quarter saw Farragine take over. The second team all shore football standout was able to attack the rim at will. Once again, the Bucks spread the floor and that gives Farragine room to operate. The hoop and the foul there. Red Bank Regional with a 37-22 lead. Farragine was also able to get his teammates involved. Mammoth Regional clogs the lane. Farragine able to adjust and feed Owen Lachlan for the easy lay-in. The Bucks were able to apply a whole bunch of pressure for all four quarters, and the result was turnovers and easy buckets. Farragine closes out the third quarter with two more buckets. Farragine had 19 points to lead the way at the end of three. It's RBR in control with a 50-24 lead. Drew Valentino joined Farragine, handling the scoring load for Red Bank. Valentino finished the night with 16 points. Red Bank Regional cruises to a 65-32 win over Mammoth Regional to get their first win of the season. RBR will face top-seeded St. Thomas Aquinas in the semis of the Buck Classic. In Little Silver, I'm Jay Cook for JerseySportsZone.com.